Hey guys, it's me Ashley. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for watching my videos, subscribing, and thumbsing up my videos, if that is even a word, thumbsing. So yes, let's just go ahead and get right in. Today's video is going to be a makeup haul. Um, these are some of the items that I have accumulated over the past month of October. Um, I don't know if you all follow me on Instagram, which you should. Um, my birthday was October 28th, and so I kind of did a little bit of makeup shopping. Nothing too big and nothing too serious. I don't want you to think I was out here just <laughs> spending my life away because, no, we ain't about that life around here. I'm just going to go ahead and jump right in because I don't know what to start with first. I hope that you all enjoy this video, so stay tuned. First, I did a little bit of online shopping. Um, I have been eyeing this company for a while because they have very pigmented products. And if you haven't seen my Arabian Night tutorial, then you should go ahead and check that out. It features one of the lipsticks, which is called Arabian Night. The lipsticks that I am talking about are from Colored Rain Cosmetics. And it comes in these pink tubes, it says Colored Rain. And the first lipstick that I got from them, well, I ordered them all at the same time, but this is called Arabian Night. And it's a beautiful purple color. It really makes the teeth look white, I will say that. So if you need something to do that for you, it will do that for you. And the next lipstick is called Black Dahlia. And Black Dahlia is like a satin finish. Arabian Night is a matte finish. So those are those two lipsticks. That I have a MAC here where I live. Excuse me. But I didn't want to go in the store. I kind of just wanted to be comfort comfortable in my own home. So the first thing I got was Smolder Eye Coal Pencil which is just a very black pencil and also Night Moth Lip Liner. I have been wanting to try these products for a while. Next up, I went to Sephora on a whim. One day I was like, you know, I wanna go to Sephora and I wanna try something new out. So that's what I did. I went to Sephora on the hunt for this. This is the NARS Sheer Matte Foundation. This is the packaging. I'm pretty sure you have seen it. And my color that I was matched with, if I can get it out the box. So today it doesn't want to come out the box, but it's been coming out good ever since. I got it home. So the color I got was Dark 3 in Trinidad. Of course, this is the packaging. And I have used this foundation in a few of my looks here recently. So I will leave those linked below so that you can see how it applies. And I really like this foundation so far. It does give a matte finish. And I like the sheerness because it is more natural. So it is a matte finish. It gives natural appearance to the face. So I am enjoying this. I was also on the hunt for a new primer. Um, currently, I use the Maybelline Baby Skin. I was using the number seven um, primer, the Beautifully Matte Primer, and I wanted something different. Um, and we all know when you get to Sephora or Ulta, they have the booby trap right at the counter. And this primer was there. This is the, I don't know if y'all can see that. Maybe. This is the Cover FX Mattifying Primer with Anti-Acne Treatment. And so far, so good. I like to still use my primers that I've been using before, but I like to add this to the T-zone because that's where I'm most oily. And so that's where I want to be more matte. And I've also noticed that I have bigger pores right here around the nose area so I apply it there. So far so good. Let me know if you want to see an in-depth review of the product and I will get on that as soon as I can. So my next place to go to was Ulta. 
I didn't go in there for specifically anything. I went in there just because I had my birthday coupon and I also had a 20% off coupon that I wanted to use on something just to splurge on myself and make myself feel pretty. So yes, the first thing I got, it's not in here with me, it's in my bathroom, but I got the, um, it's a vitamin C cleanser. I couldn't call the name of it for you, but I will leave it in the description box below. So, but it's the next product is I got this Christmas set. This is the Laura Geller Sweet Sensations Five Piece Full Collection Set. It comes with a duo ended brush, a blush, a lovely highlighter, guys. I swatched this in the store and I fell in love. And then a duo eyeshadow and a lipstick as well. Um, give me just a moment. I'll pull this out so you can see it. For yourself <laughs> um i know that it gives a really bright pink effect but i really wanted this for just kind of like a wash of color and you can build it up this blush is in berry cream very pretty all right so the highlighter the highlighter y'all tell me you don't like it well, don't tell me you don't like it, but <laughs> oh my god, I can't wait to use it. This is called Gilded Honey. <sighs> Be all over my face, honey. I'm just saying. Just saying. All right. So this is the dual eyeshadow. Just a pretty um, champagne-y rose color and a chocolate color on the other side. This is called Pink Icing and Devil's Food. Ew. This is the brush. It has the sponge tip applicator on one side and this kind of an angled bl blush brush or contour brush on the other. I'm probably not going to use this side because I'm not into the whole foam tip applicator. But I mean, hey, five piece set for $39. You can't beat that. And this is the lipstick. Um, I swatched it in store. It's very sheer. So I guess on those days that I kind of want to go for something natural, I will use this. A birthday oh. present. And all you have to do is print off the coupon. My birthday present, well, everybody's birthday present, is a full-size CK1 mascara. Now, they were out of the birthday mascaras because they keep those behind the counter. And I lucked up and just was able to pick the one I wanted. I got the CK1 Volumizing Mascara. This is what it looks like. White top with CK1 on the top and a black bottom. And it just tells you CK1 Volumizing Mascara. I have used this mascara and I really like it. This is the brush. A very big brush, but it's not harsh when you apply Try a new brand of makeup and also a different face powder because I've been using the heck out of my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish. So first off I went to Clinique, well I only went to Clinique and I got a face powder. This is the Stay Matte Sheer Press Powder for Oil Free Skin or Oil Free and my color is in the color Stay Brandy. This is the packaging, very just sleek green packaging. And it tells you on the back what it says. It says 11 Stay Brandy D, D meaning deep. Comes with an applicator. I was out and I didn't have a travel makeup brush set with me, so I used this to just kind of blot because I didn't want to be oily. And this is what the color looks like. I used it today in this video. Well, in my makeup tutorial. I hope that you like this tutorial. I will leave it here so that you can click on it and watch. But this is the powder. I have really been enjoying this. Um, it is. It does help you stay matte. Um, you're not going to be completely matte unless you just suck all the oils out of your face. Let's just get real. So I like it. I like the coverage that it gives. It's very natural, um, but it also just kind of helps to combat the oils so they don't come through like, yeah. So yeah. Next product is a 
quick liner for eyes intense and the color i got it in is 09 intense ebony this is what it looks like just a black eyeliner pencil i've been on a hunt for some really good black eyeliners and it is a roll-up so it's an automatic eye pencil so you don't have to worry about sharpening it um i tried this before the mac one i like both um i like this one because when you put it on it's extremely dark and it's a little bit more creamier so you can smudge it out but all in all i like both of them i like the smolder for the waterline if i want to smudge and smoke out that lower lash line baby this is gonna be my go-to so yes also got the bottom lash mascara and it's a small box i didn't want to really show you the boxes but this is the packaging it's just so pretty and dainty a very small mascara and you can see it is a small applicator tip it is perfect for getting into those lower lashes i'm talking about you can get them in pull them out and just lash line drama girl so yes Clinique Bottom Lash Mascara. Um, also, I went to the CCO that is out in Destin where Sephora is. And I got a soft and gentle highlighter. I got this specifically for my kit. I don't really like this highlighter on me. I don't like pinky highlighters on me. So this is specifically for my makeup kit. Just, you know, something to add. And hey, like I said, you know, birthday money. <laughs> Spend it. So, yes. Oh, also... Um, from Clinique, they gave me a little birthday gift. This is their Chubby Stick Moisturizing Lip Balm in a Chunky Cherry 05. And it's just, you roll it up and you can roll it down. You can roll it up or you can roll it down. So yes, I mean, something to keep in the purse, give um a flush of color or a wash of color to the lips so that you know they're not just chap because that's not cute what haul would be complete without lashes i i i couldn't help myself so don't judge me don't judge me it is what it is i have my packing slip because i i mean i didn't get that many different variety i just got a lot of num you know a lot of quantity a big quantity of a certain kind of lash i hope that makes sense so i ordered from shopmissa.com i mean a dollar for lashes and really good quality lashes yeah great for your kit great for your personal makeup stash give to your friends who like makeup i mean hey what more can you ask for so i got the el 048 so the number 48s i got 10 of those because those are my favorites uh if you watched a few of my other videos when i tell you i put on those 48 lashes all the time i did i also got the 747 s's which are 748, 747 smalls. I got those specifically for clients who want a natural lash, but want a little bit of volume. So you can add those to the lashes and it's just strictly going to make you look, make them look thicker. Um, I got the 42s and also the 43s. So yes, yeah, so yes, that pretty much completes my makeup haul um i would say my birthday makeup haul but my birthday is gone and i miss filming this on that day so whatever um yes so don't forget to rate comment and subscribe give this video a thumbs up and let me know if you are enjoying the video content i am putting out as always thank you for watching my videos and i will talk to you later bye